Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel for today's video. I am kind of switching it up a little bit. As you can tell by the title of this video, we are doing a Soho House Home Haul. And I have this box here, came really quick. Um, and you know, I love a good haul. I love showing all things, you know, beauty and clothes but for the first time ever I think I'm doing my first actual like home wear haul I guess long story short I have a membership at Soho House here in Chicago um unfortunately though due to the pandemic happening they actually would not waive the fee of your membership for how much you pay so what they ended up doing was they pretty much gave me a voucher gift card to use either at their Soho House Home website or at my house in the Chicago. If you don't know what Soho House is, I mean, you can look it up and see what it is. It's pretty much like a members only, all exclusive, like, thing. I don't even know what to call it, but it's pretty much for, like, creatives quote unquote. Um, it's just for people who are like either like CEOs or like business people, um, you know, influencers, that type of stuff. I had a membership for a really long time. I ended up canceling my membership because I just don't go there anymore. I just like don't go there anymore. And to be quite honest, like it is just so hoity-toity, pretty much everything you've ever think, thought of. If you you probably have heard Soho House before because there was like a huge like PR blow up about how Kim Kardashian was rejected from Soho House because she's too famous. <laughs> right, so um, anyways, I had to spend $300 worth of stuff on Soho House's website because that's how much my credit was for. So I'm gonna show you guys everything I got. Before we get into the video, make sure you guys subscribe. Please help me hit a thousand subscribers. Let's go. If we do it, I'm doing a giveaway. Y'all are gonna be lit about it. So subscribe. Thank you. Right, so here's the box. I literally haven't seen really anything at all. So this is a card, a Soho Home card. It's a gift saying if you spend $300 or more, you'll get a free $50 candle. I already spent the $300, so give me my money. All right, there's this weird stuff in here. Ooh, okay, so <laughs> right out the bag, we have a tote bag. This was so funny. I told Scott I was buying like three of these tote bags and he's like, why do we need a tote bag? I'm like, uh, because they're so cute. All right, so first of all, you can see the like little striped print and then in the very corner of it, you can see the little Soho House emblem there. It's really just like a plain canvas tote bag. But I feel like it's a little bit cute. It's a little bit more upscale, you know, than your average tote. So I do like that. Like just so much paper in here. Oh my god, these are so cute. Okay, I do you remember this? Oh my gosh, yes. Okay, so like literally I bought the most random shit. Um, so this is a laundry bag, as you can see in the corner, and then on the back there's a little um embroidery of the Soho House emblem but it's pretty much just like a laundry bag essentially what I was thinking for this is me and Scott are going on a trip soon so I was like this would be perfect to throw like all your dirty clothes in and then you know you put it back in your suitcase so you don't mix your dirty clothes with your clean clothes but this was so cute and again I just love like the aesthetics the aesthetics y'all it's working for me oh yes my hand towels <laughs> also guys just so you know Soho House home stuff is like kind of stupidly expensive <sighs> a few of the items I will show you were like really stupidly expensive all right so I got a set I got two sets of two house face cloths I don't even know literally just a basic white towel I don't know I figured these might be nice for like when we have guests come over maybe 
or when you clean your face, what they're meant for. It's just like the shit I bought is like so stupid, honestly. I bought a set of four bread plates. I'm a little Soho House emblem. It's so funny that they sell this stuff. It's hilarious. I gotta say, so this is like so like silky smooth and soft. Ass bear. Anyways, bread plates. Honestly though, me and Scott don't really have just like very tiny like appetizer plates. So I think we'll actually use these a lot. And I figured they're not like exactly the same thing as our current set, but they're white plates. I mean, can't go wrong with them. This is a lot smaller than I thought. <laughs> oh, I probably should have read the description on some of these items. Like, I legitimately have no idea how big this is. Oh, I guess it's actually a really good size. So next thing that I bought, picture. <laughs> I have been, why does this like look used? I'm so confused. It's made in Mexico. That's cool. I have been needing just like a plain glass pitcher. Um, I love making iced tea or iced coffees in the summer months, but the pitcher that I currently have is plastic and I've been like pouring boiling hot water like to make the iced tea in in the pitcher and then putting it in the fridge and it like caused it to like crack all over the place. So I needed a glass pitcher anyway. Thought this was good for summer, just storing it in the fridge. I also like that it's like this recycled glass, which I have a recycled glassware line from Pottery Barn. So I think it'll all kind of like match together a little bit better. And the last thing is this $165 blanket. Oh my gosh. It's actually really soft though. Me and Scott are actually getting new bedding soon, which I'm so stoked about. Um, but I've been much, much more into like the creams and browns and neutrals. So I saw this blanket and I was like, hey, we need new bedding anyway. This would be perfect on our bed. It looks and it now feels like super luxurious and expensive, which it really fucking was. Oh my God, is this wool? Fuck, it's wool. Okay, so this is wool, which means it's probably gonna get all over the place, but I really think this will be more decorative than anything. I mean, wool goes everywhere. Oh my God, look at how, this is a huge blanket. Oh my gosh. Again, guys, this was $165. So I don't recommend spending that much on a blanket from Soho House. I mean, if you're gonna spend $165, girl, take yourself to Restoration Hardware, Pottery Barn, Crate and Barrel, it's the, it's in the it's in my mouth it's in my lip gloss it's in my ring but that's okay we'll make it work all right guys and that is everything i bought at soho house for 300 dollars. <laughs> once again everything was super random so crazy i mean like a pitcher laundry bags i mean you name it they have so much good stuff some of the stuff was pretty inexpensive some of it was a little bit more expensive i mean this was like so $70. But anyways, um, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Make sure you thumbs up this video if you liked it. If you want more home decor haul, something like this, um, make sure you thumbs it up. Also, make sure you guys follow me on my like to know it and Instagram. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!